All right. This is my new uh, tea candle stove that I built around the cast iron skillet. And uh, the first test is going to be teriyaki chicken, teriyaki uh, spam. I've been wanting to try this for a while. So uh, let me get this slid up under there. Get that pan warmed up while I cut the... Uh, Well, I cut the spam. By the time I get this spam sliced, maybe that pan will start getting warm. Well, uh, I'm gonna need both hands for this, so let me get this open and get it sliced. I just got it in there, but uh, I tried a taste of this. What do you think? Does that pass? Does that meet with your approval? This is really good. I mean, definitely got a teriyaki flavor and even raw. Well, not raw, but you know what I mean. Not cooked yet. Not heated up. Hmm. Good stuff. All right. Well, uh, when it starts sizzling, I'll bring you back. <clears throat> if it's hot enough to sizzle spam, it's hot enough to cook bacon. Are you as excited as I am? Five candles. It, it took about 10 minutes to get it this warm with five candles. If I had put the full nine candles in there, this would be really sizzling right now. I just wanted to see if I could do it with five. Very cool. So this is oh, probably 10 or 12 minutes into it now. Well, I flipped them and I, I added this one. And uh, they're definitely cooking. We're about 23 minutes into this, and, uh, and I wish I had not. I wish I had put nine candles in. Uh, it's doing it with five, but this would really cook them fast with nine candles. But uh, I'm very happy with this, and uh, yeah, you can almost you can almost pick this up. It's not so terribly hot that uh, if you had to, you couldn't pick this up and move it. So I'm really happy. Uh, we're almost done here. Nice. Here's another something that I've learned. These, this bag is uh, dollar store candles. And uh, this is Walmart. USA uh, USA Candle Company and there's definitely a difference in the candles this wick on the uh, dollar store first of all this wax it, it doesn't it, it doesn't stay lit very well and when you do light it that string there it just just turns into nothing and there's just barely a flame and these the USA Walmart brand the uh, wick uh, stays that size and it burns, definitely burns hotter and a higher flame. So that's something to uh, take into consideration too when you're looking for tea light candles. I guess these would be okay for lighting, but they're not nearly as good as these are for, for heating food, for cooking food. So I'm gonna be looking for more of these there's absolutely a difference in uh, how well each of these work, and I've only tried these two. These were from the Dollar Tree, and this was in a hundred pack at Walmart, and it's made by a company called uh, USA Candle or USA Tea Candle. Uh, I found a video <clears throat> on YouTube of this company that makes them and how they, how they make them. Just, it was pretty cool. And I'm sure these are made in China. Anyway, thought I'd thought I'd let you know that I have discovered there's an absolute difference in uh, how well they stay lit and how well they heat. And this beats it on both counts. The USA made one. Okay, back to the spam. Well, I am just tickled pink with that there. That worked great. And uh, I guarantee you, if I had nine in there, uh, I could have had this. Uh, sizzle in and cooked in uh, 10 minutes. 
uh, five did it, and I, you know five would uh, that would cook bacon with five, but it would cook it a lot quicker with four more candles in there. So this is a success. I'm very happy with that. Wow. Yep. Alrighty, uh, I'm gonna eat a little spam. It's not on my diet because it has sugar in it, but I'm gonna eat a couple of pieces. Maybe share a piece. And uh, thanks for watching. This has been a very fun project.